What's up traders? This is V Trace and today I will be doing a technical analysis breakdown for Meta Platforms with the ticker symbol META. I will first be going over what I see on the daily chart and finish the video off with the weekly chart. This video is for entertainment purposes only. Please trade at your own risk. So Meta Platforms was consolidating at its all-time highs. That's basically expected because whenever price gets uh, really overextended, you can see a correction take place in the form of sideways trading or a downward correction. So we can represent that with this uh, channel or range and you see that sideways pattern uh, is e easier to recognize support right around the 480 resistance right around the low 520s or the 500s and you see that price was able to eventually break out to the bottom so this is basically a fake breakout or it's most likely gonna be a fail breakout due to that earnings support a lot of times they will use this earnings report to move that around the price when there's lower liquidity it's hard for them to do it uh, when there's a lot of liquidity when the market opens so why is earnings report always coming out before market open or after market open when the liquidity is lower so that way you can see a sharp move up in a uh, upward direction or a large direction downward so basically price was probably trying to come back to fill in this gap right here this empty space you see there's a huge gap right here by a previous earnings report a lot of times price will try to come back to fill in these uh empty spaces on the chart and you see that they almost reached it so now since they kind of failed and we are overextended we have another gap to fill to the upside so most likely they're going to be it's probably easier to fill in the gap to the upside now so that's what they're coming back to do so it looks like we're going to be seeing higher prices for meta platforms probably all up to the 480 and maybe even back inside the orange range so short term it is looking pretty good right now we have this bullish trend line in play or you could say a bullish momentum overextended from the ema uh and price is probably trying to come back to fill in the gap so it looks pretty good uh, that's just one thing you can also like zoom out look at this trend line right here drag it off the swings and you can see that fits pretty good off the trend line so that's another reason why we bounce exactly right here and not at the gap field at the 406 we stopped right around the uh, 415 420 level and we're seeing price resume higher so short term is looking bullish for meta platforms you can see that price is overextended from that ema price eventually comes back to the ema to the downside eventually comes to the ema and even the upside, it'll eventually come to the EMA. So we are definitely overextended. Came back to the EMA, saw a bounce. We have, you know, these trend lines in play. And it looks like it's ready to uh, move up higher. So it looks like a very large bubble. So we can do a measure move target from uh, its inception, baiting back to probably like, you know, 2012, 2013, the lows. You drag it up to this swing right here. And that's basically a measure move target met right around the 464. Uh, but you know, if price does want to continue higher, where does it want to go? Well, let's take a look at the log chart, see if we can find um, something else uh, for this. So you can see that as long as price is still kind of following this trend line right here, I'll be expecting higher prices. Let's go and clone the trend line, make a channel. You can see that we're finding resistance at the top side, finding support at the bottom side of the trend line or the channel. Uh, so there's room back up to the upside, so room back up to the all-time highs, possibly even, you know, somewhere in the five high 500s, low 600s could be the next target sometime possibly um, later this year, maybe uh, Q2, Q3, L later in Q2, early Q3. So all I have for Meta Platforms on the daily weekly charts. This is a V trace and thank you for your time.